Et bien ça tout le monde, je suis Mika et aujourd'hui on se retrouve pour l'épisode numéro 6 de Call of Duty Slinger. J'espère que vous allez bien. Et on est parti. I dodged death many a time, and that night in Abilene was no different. Why is that son bitch still standing? I was there with the intention of finding that bastard Bob and collecting the bounty on John Wesley. He'll kill us all! There he is! Huh, I thought the Texas Rangers got heart. Yeah, <laughs> that's what they want you to believe. It was cold in the witch's tit in a brass bra that night as I fought my way past his loyal compadres <clears throat> to the very same saloon we're sitting in today. Look around and imagine this place painted in blood. Harden was waiting for me and... Wait, I'm jumping the gun here. Let me back up and give you some background on this some bitch. <laughs> he deserves that much. Don't you think so, Ben? John Wesley Hardin was a killer. By the end, he confessed to taking the lives of 42 men. He was a bona fide folk hero by then, and had amassed a gang of armed miscreants and other assorted thugs. He and his men set up camp outside of town, and I was hoping Bob was among them. Stop, damn it! Shoot that son of a bitch! They didn't ask why I was there. They knew. As most of them were wanted as well. Kill me! I figured Harden was here somewhere, but to get to him, I'd have to get past his gun hands. I had to spill a lot of blood to find out Harden wasn't in that camp. He was carousing in town with his closest friends. Harden's boys apparently didn't want me to reach the bull's head. Some were hightailing it into town to inform their jefe of my unwelcomed presence. You bastard! Stop that some bitch! Let the boys know we got another law dog. Time to feel I wondered if Bob was among them. And I steeled myself for the fight ahead. For as good as I was, deep down I wondered if John Wesley wasn't just a little bit better. Before I could test my medal against Harden, however, I would first need to dispatch his cadre of hired killers. Most of these degenerates were beyond redemption, but John Wesley might have been a different story. Don't let him live! I didn't learn until later that that night was in fact his birthday celebration. Can't get a good 
I think I already mentioned that I found Hardin in this very saloon. Suffice it to say, nobody there was happy to see me. In fact, I felt a certain hostility. Did that asshole just kill Red? I was disappointed that neither Bob nor John Wesley were among the dead. But that was short-lived, as a moment later I was facing down the fastest gun in the West. I felt a bolt of adrenaline, or maybe that was fear. He was well known for his tricks, and I knew I'd need my own if I was ever to defeat him. No, wait! <laughs> he didn't hit me then! I'm sure of it!
That man was faster than Grease Lightning. But being inebriated as he was, he didn't count his shots. And now, he was at my mercy. So he didn't die? No, I sent him to prison. Years later, after he was free, some restless Avenger took his life. Shot him in the back in a saloon just like this one. Anybody up for another beer? Ben? <laughs> Bon, euh, moi je vous dis à la prochaine pour un épisode de... Euh... Une heure. Euh, C'est vrai que vous avez dit ça.